Alright guys, I'm back. Um, I really didn't need to go off screen apparently. <clears throat> I thought that I had to because, um, I remember the war table operation being that you had to, you know, wait a little bit. But, that is for a special option if you have the Underworld Knowledge perk. Uh, other than that, you have spend one favor and you can get it. You know, like, eh, that pissant lord owes me a favor. Let's use him. Which is pretty much what I did. So, yay, let's continue. Now, if I did the, if I remember correctly, the next one on this judgment should be uh, Blackwall, which is what I want. If not, I'm starting the recording for um, judgments, which I don't want to do because I want to save those for after the game. So, I tried it earlier; it should be fine. For judgment this day, Inquisitor, I must present Captain Tom Rainier, formerly known to us as Warden Blackwall. His crimes, well, you are aware of his crimes. It was no small expense to bring him here, but the decision of what to do with him is now yours. I didn't think this would be easy, but it's harder than I thought. Another thing to regret. I know you put another man in my place. Haven't enough died for me. I really think you've lost the right to judge anyone. There's enough evil in the world because of me. I accepted my punishment. I was ready for all this to end. Why would you stop it? What becomes of me now? You have your freedom. It cannot be as simple as that. It isn't. You're free to atone as the man you are, not the traitor you thought you were, or the warden you pretended to be. The man I am. I barely know him. But he... I... have a lot to make up for. If my future is mine, then I pledge it to the Inquisition. My sword is yours. If I'd said anything less, would an arrow from the rookery have snuffed me like a candle? Take your post, Tom Rainier. <laughs> One of the arrows reference to my relationship to Sarah. Well, I guess we'll find out in the other playthroughs, won't we? Okay, so we did that. Um, all that's left for companions other than Varric is the Cassandra quest. Call doesn't have anything else for us. None of these guys do. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Alright. I did that. Don't know about that just yet. Let us go and do this. <clears throat> Get this quest out, done out of the way. Uh, my mage Dorian. For her. Alright, let's get going. <laughs> we'll switch over to, uh... Yeah. I don't know where I was going with that. <laughs> Mine kind of went blank. <laughs> Alrighty then. Well, there should be some upgrades. Let's see. Nope. Just with her. Alright, let's go. I haven't used uh, Cassandra in a while. Yeah, kind of okay. weird. Odd that the trail should lead us here. Ban Loren is a pious, unassuming man. What has he become involved in? He's involved in crazy. Like a man these days. Your words have never been spoken. <laughs> let's see what lies within. Yep, let's go. <clears throat> Hello. Fuck you. 
Ah, it's nice to get into some battle again. I still share one's uh, weapons over to superb dragon slaying runes. We'll be using that a little bit later on. I should have known. The order of fiery promise is a cult with strange beliefs about the seekers. They've hounded us for centuries. Cultists, why am I not surprised? This explains why the seekers might be here, but not the connection to Corisia. Yeah, maybe. Oh. We are. Dead Seeker, ah, great. A Seeker. Did they torture him to death? The promisers will pay for this. <laughs> kick. I did an aerial kick nowhere near the fucker's head. Love it. Poison. Dorian, I saw some fireballs here. What the fuck? Someone just flew into the air. Want loot? Yeah, okay. Woo! Boom. Oh, that poor bastard. Didn't see it coming. Right, one of these guys' bodies has it. This one. As the Seekers of Truth have proven resistant to the effects of Red Lyrian, the Elder One has seen fit to place them in your care. We claim your destiny and know that the Elder One expects your devotion as repayment. Signed by Lord Samson, Commander of the Red Templars. Does Corythius not realize the promises want the world to end? What use are they to him? Corythius will probably betray them before they get their chance. But after he gets what he needs out of them. But this doesn't explain how he captured the Seekers in the first place, or what's been done with them. We must keep looking. Do you really want to keep looking? What we find might not be pleasant. I do not shy away from unpleasant things. I must know. Alrighty then, if you're insistent. And there it is. So I saw some news recently. Um, the Jaws of Hakan, uh, the DLC, I'm probably mispronouncing that horribly, should be coming out to the PS4 uh, sometime within either this week or maybe next week. That or they're just announcing uh, more information about it for the other consoles. This gives you a good uh, timeline of when I'm recording this. It's actually the 20th of March. <laughs> um... I plan to, at least I hope to, have the, uh, oop, sorry, the rest of Inquisition uploaded by the time the DLC comes out. I really want to do a day one, um, video of the DLC for, uh, the consoles. For, uh, uh for the non-Microsoft consoles, I should say. Ah. The Fraudin Throne. I like it. But we'll have to see on that. I'm not 100% sure when that's going to be the case. I don't need that loot. I'm fine as I am. Daniel! Daniel! Can you hear me? Cassandra. It is you. You're alive. As are you. I'm so glad I found you. No, they put a, a demon inside me, tearing me up. What? You can't be possessed. That's impossible. I'm not possessed. They fed me things. I can feel it growing. From there. The Lord Seeker. An important mission, he said. Lies. He was here with them all along. He's still working with them. 
Sorry about that, uh, my recorder was acting up. Um, I really hope that it got all that. If not, I'm really sorry. Would he really work with these cultists? I intend to find out. Wait. Don't leave me like this, please. You should have come with me. You didn't believe in the war any more than I did. You know me. I wanted that promotion. <coughs> Go to the Maker's side, Danny. You will be welcome. He was so my sad. apprentice. I have never known a finer young man. Now we find Lord Seeker Lucius. Yeah, and we kill him. A dick. Surprised none of them had anything to comment on. Well, they probably didn't know what to say. <clears throat> Hello. Bye, Archer. <laughs> Saw Cassandra pull the fucker away. Come on. Dead. Just in time for me to teleport behind that bastard. And put away my daggers. Whew. Love the light effect. That's not a hard thing to do with uh, programming, as far as I know. Lord Seeker Lucius. Cassandra. With a woman I can only assume is the new Inquisitor. Call off your men, or this only ends one way. I presume you know we Seekers of Truth were once the original Inquisition. Oh, yes. We fought to restore order in a time of madness long ago, as you do now. And we became proud. We sought to remake the world, to make it better. But what did we create? The Chantry, the Circles of Magi. A war that will see no end. And aiding Corypheus is supposed to help? Corypheus is a monster with limited ambition. And your ambition is so much greater. We Seekers are abominations, Cassandra. We created a decaying world and fought to preserve it even as it crumbled. We had to be stopped. You don't believe me? See for yourselves. The secrets of our order passed to me after the former Lord Seeker was slain. The war with the mages had already begun, but it was not too late for me to do the right thing. He's completely mad, isn't he? Lord Seeker, what you've done... I know. What Corypheus did with the Templars does not matter. I have seen the future. I have created a new order to replace the old. The world will end so we can start anew. A pure beginning. Join us, Cassandra. It is the Maker's will. That wasn't the short sword she has equipped. <laughs> she pulled out in that cutscene. That was a straight edge. If you look at the one that she currently has, it's pretty bowed. <laughs> Hey, stab in the back. He was insane. He had to be. The influence of Corypheus, perhaps? Was he trying to disable the Seekers? 
If so, the plan works perfectly. He could not have destroyed all of us. I won't accept it. Let us return to Skyhold. I wish to see what's in this book of secrets. Well, if you pay enough money, you can watch the movie with Nicolas Cage. Yeah. Anyway, enough of that shite. And bad jokes. Let's get out of here. <laughs> kind of wish I could latch onto those, you know, um, lanterns and yank myself over there as well. But if that's the case, I'd be flying all over the fucking place during battle. Okay, uh, we did that. Um, hmm. Do I want to finish these quests, or do I want to do something else first? Uh, let's finish this quest, and then we'll do... Uh, Varric side quest. Probably should have done that before I left. Fuck. Yeah, let's hop over to Varric side quest. Get that done now, the way. <clears throat> that way, all the uh, cutscenes we have are that are left, or we will be here in town. Here, here in Skyhold, I should say. Come on. There we are. Um, let's see here. Hinterlands, over here. Mark. And fast travel. We'll switch, switch out Cassandra for Varric. Wow. Everyone but Souls has a new card. And due to our current uh, way of doing things, I don't think he's, that's going to change until the end of the game. Well, until near the end of the game, I should say. You'll have opinions about your adventures. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Thankfully, if I'm rem remembering correctly, I have actually spent time and upgraded Bianca. At least most of her has been upgraded. I don't think the uh, crossbow portion has been upgraded. But the hilt, or the main body, the scope, and the uh, handle has. No, oh, Bianca's been upgraded by quite a bit by the looks of it. Beric, on the other hand, has not. Let's take a look at Bianca. Yep. <clears throat> Everything's been upgraded except for a rune. FYI, he's wearing a Legion of the Dead armor. I, uh, <laughs> I used the, um, uh, what was it called? Dale's Loden Wool or something like that. Is a unique cloth equipment, or, um, piece, I guess. <laughs> uh, material. There we go. If you equip it to something that has a that doesn't have a race specific um, effect to it, such as equipping it to a uh, heavy armor, you can remove the class restriction to the armor. So I can equip any um, equipment to any character so long as it's not a race specific effect, and so long as it has a um, uh, what's it called? <laughs> I might went blank. As long as it has a cloth section to it. Apparently, I had a masterwork that does the same effect. But apparently, it doesn't work on all of the masterworks. Hmm. Kind of weird. Let's look into that. Because I tried using it on another character, and it didn't quite work very well. Oh, well. Like I said, I'll look into it a little bit more. I tried to give uh, Lilith a different armor, but it didn't work very well. Kind of irritated the hell out of me, but yeah, whatever. Yeah, the um, Legion of the De Dead armor doesn't have a cloth slot. I don't think it did. I think it had uh, just three metal and a leather. But I used the Masterwork one, and it got to work. Got to work. Finally. So 
surprised to think you weren't coming. Nobody said you had to hang out in the creepy cave while you waited. Well, I did wait, so let's make this quick. These idiots are carrying the Red Lyria Mountain unprotected containers. We don't want to stick around long enough for them to start talking to us. You'd better get to work. Sounds good to me. If <laughs> Eric looks so weird in that bulky armor. Still looks pretty cool though. I'll probably switch over to uh, different armor later on. But I just wanted the extra oomph for him, you know? Hi. Yeah, you guys are fucked. I'll let them take care of them. Now, if I'm remembering correctly, I've already been down here. I think I did that, like, you know, three or four sets ago. That. So this is what you do now? Beg pardon? Skulking around in caves, shooting guys. Is this your day to day? I usually try to avoid the caves. Yeah, usually. Boom. Hi. Dark spawn. Hi, Bianca. Simple. There we go. And here's our door. Worried, you know. What did I do now? That letter you sent me about the Red Lyrium was the first I'd heard from you since the Chantry explosion. Had it been that long? Seriously, if you died in that mess, I'd have come back to Kirkwall and dug you up just to kick your ass. What would you do if I'd been cremated? Kick your ashes, of course. I like her. <laughs> I built these doors. They probably shut this one from the other side when they heard the ruckus we were making. Ta-da! Admit it. You've been waiting to do that since we arrived. <laughs> of course I was. After you. <laughs> Love how Nexus and Bianca became quick, fan quick friends. Kick in the face. Slow down time. I kind of wish that my other characters get, didn't get affected by that as well. But I still understand why. There we are. Simplicity itself. How is what's his name? Bogdan? He's in Navarra right now, selling my machine to wealthy landowners. I heard some of the guild were trying to get you named a paragon for that contraption. That's not gonna happen. Even if I am ten times as Miss Bronca of a one. A surfacer <laughs> paragon? Never. It'd be kinda cool if she uh, became a paragon. We'd have more uh, pull than with the dwarves, that's what I'm sure. Face. Every time I do that, I need the uh, boot to the head thing to play. If I was a better editor, I'd still have that. Hey, Everywhere! You know, this is almost fun. Kinda like old times. I don't recall us ever shooting people together. Remember crashing Bartram's guild dinner? We might as well have shot him. This isn't nearly as dangerous <laughs> as pissing off my brother. Yeah, Borchin was pretty was a pretty uh hard ass. Alright, what's in the big box? Nothing worthwhile. And what's in in the little jug? Soul Wrecker Staff. That's nifty. Now before you get this key, uh, make sure you loot everything. I don't really see a door leading to the deep roads in here. Oh well. There you are. I won't be able to use this entrance again. Bianca. 
you want to say something, Barrett? Contraste that, Bianca. You're the leak? When I got the location, I went and had a look for myself. And I found the red lyrium, and I studied it. You know what it does to people. I was doing you a favor. You've had people studying it for years now, and they've come up with nothing. I just wanted to figure it out. How did you go from studying red lyrium to giving the location to Corypheus? I found out that red lyrium, it has the flight, Beric. Do you know what that means? What? The two deadly things combined to form something super awful? Lyrium is alive, or something like it. Light doesn't infect minerals, only animals. I couldn't get any further on my own, so I looked for a Grey Warden mage. Blight and magical expertise in one, right? And I found this guy, Lorias. He seemed really interested in helping my research. So I gave him a key. Lorias? He was the Grey Warden we met in Corypheus's... Oh, shit. I knew something seemed off. I didn't realize until you said you found Red Lyrium at Haven. I came here and, well, then I went to you. You told Varric you had a lead, so we'd straighten out your mistake. I know I screwed up, but we did fix it. It's as right as I can make it. This isn't one of your machines. You can't just replace a part and make everything right. No, but I can try, can't I? Or am I supposed to wallow in my mistakes forever, kicking myself, telling stories of what I should have done? Ha! As if I would tell stories about my own mistakes. Oh, for pity's sake, did you two just get a room? Sorry, Inquisitor. We've done all we can here. Bianca, you'd better get home before someone misses you. Varric. Don't worry. Get him killed, and I'll feed you your own eyeballs, Inquisitor. Remind me again why those two are together. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, let's turn in the quest to uh, Cassandra and then Varric. As soon as we get out of here. Still a very pretty place. Awkward silence. How did they get a brazier burning up there? Yeah, they probably had some dude climb it. Can I fast travel from in here? Nope. Nope. Oh, well. I'll go away in a second. And there goes the poison. There. That took a while. <laughs> Didn't realize my poison lasted that long. Not that bother me, bothers me, it means I can fuck people up more. Hmm. Probably can be healed with potions or by resting at Inquisition camps. Healing potions can be restocked to supply caches and camps. Now, I know a lot of people don't like the fact that we have limited potions, but I love the fact that they balance that out with you don't have to buy them anymore. Love that. All you need to do is go to a uh, camp and rest. Simple as that. If you don't have a camp, but you have a restock spot. All I need is uh, elf root. Makes things so much easier. All right. Stop by Skyhold, get that done, and then we'll start raiding dungeons. Because after this quest, I believe, or after these quests, I believe we're done with all the companion quests. Could be wrong. Probably am. Although, um, if my memory is correct, we are, I'm, I'm not wrong with that. Other than uh, Liliana's, which we need to do as well. 